out of the thousand submissions that you receive, how many of them are actually the caliber that you would consider for the festival? I'd say, say 20%. Okay. So let's say 200 out of, mind, in my mind. So out of a, say out of a thousand, I would think 200 of them. I mean, I have friends that I think that should be in it that don't even get into the festival. <laughs> That's how like tight our selection team is, is that they don't let any person on the selection committee, even me, the creator of the festival, they don't let my personal thoughts on somebody affect who we select for the festival, which sucks because, you know, I like lobby for a lot of my friends and, you know, some of them don't get in. I'm like, what the hell? I'm like, dude, I tried. And they get mad at me. I'm like, it's not my fault, dude. Like I, <laughs> didn't have my, I didn't choose for you not to be in. Like we actually have a team and we, we were, I mean, we have agents from like CA and stuff that will pitch their, their comics to us. And I honestly, I'm like, okay, have them submit. Like we actually don't give a shit. Like if they're repped or not, what TV credits, what other festivals you've been to, like that doesn't mean shit. You gotta be funny. And it really comes down to you know, how original can you be? Have we heard this premise before? We have, have we heard this joke before? You know, can we see the punchline coming before it comes? Because there's a lot of times where I can tell you what we don't like. We don't like when you walk on stage and you have a funny name and you talk about your funny name. We've heard that a thousand times. Do not do that for a submission because we hate that. We've heard that a million times. There's no creative spin on it. I'm sorry. It just sucks. Don't don't submit that. It just we've seen it so many times, and I've I used to do that in my earlier years. So you know, it's just like we've heard everything. It doesn't matter what your name is. It's like there's just no funny spin on it to that you'll just things like things like that. Um, another thing that is not good that we also notice is if you're come from two ethnic backgrounds and you say I'm this and I'm this so that means I'm gonna do this but I'm also gonna do this like sure. heard that premise so many times and so yeah just little things like that like we're if that's in the first minute we're just like great this is gonna be horrible what other little things do you think or mistakes do you think comedians make um, as far as submission videos, crowd work, don't do that. Don't submit a crowd work video. doesn't matter if you're crushing in it. Um, and honestly, you don't have to be crushing in a video. You just got to be funny, right? So there's people just like crushing it with the audience, but it doesn't mean anything. You can honestly do your set in your living room. And as long as it sounds and looks good, you have a good... There was a video of, it was so horrible. I thought it was going to be a bad video. It was a video of somebody sitting in the audience. And I'm like, oh, great. This is going to be horrible. But he like was, on a cell phone? On a cell phone. So someone was like sitting like this with the cell phone recording him. And I just remember initially, I'm like, oh, great. This is going to suck. And he was amazing. And so we got him in to the festival. And then... In that year, he got signed by management. Uh, he got on Comedy Central, and Comedy Central gave him his own TV show. 